my role uh, as a CLO uh, for JP Morgan Chase, uh, specifically our consumer community banking business, is a bit non traditional uh, in as much as I didn't come up through a normal HR program, uh, but really had the privilege uh, to enter uh, the bank through our management development. Uh, program and processes and as a result of that uh, spent a number of time in our consumer and community banking group you know as a general manager uh, moving through various roles predominantly for our branch banking business uh, but also had the opportunity to move into our commercial bank uh, where I served as an underwriter uh, where I've had the opportunity to serve as a commercial banker. Additionally, I had the opportunity uh, to support the business, uh, specifically the commercial bank, as a client service manager for our global network. Um, having worked uh, within the commercial bank for a number of years, I also transitioned back into business banking, which is one of the sublines of businesses within the consumer community bank. It really was in that role um, where the opportunity to transition into the chief learning officer role emerged. As I think about uh, the key lessons that I've learned uh, as I've grown up inside uh, J.P. Morgan Chase, I think those lessons uh, really manifested themselves at key transitions. Uh, I think they're more memorable because that's really where there was more stress on me individually, more stress on the enterprise in terms of ensuring that I had the requisite skills and knowledge to perform effectively within the context of that new role. I think about those transitions in my role from uh, teller uh, to branch manager, from branch manager to sales manager, um, certainly from uh, leaving the consumer community bank, going into the commercial bank as a credit underwriter and moving through credit training. Um, those are experiences that I draw on today as I face new challenges, as I think about um, how do I bring together the right team members uh, to address those challenges.